here we are sitting in a 2019 Odyssey, Odyssey Honda Odyssey Elite. This has the 10 speed automatic transmission and we're getting ready to go for a road test. You know that white one, we're interested in white color. There's 10 speed. This is it right Honda Odyssey, white. And the beige interior. Nice and clean and all covered up here. Um, now, is this the all wheel drive version? Or is this just the front wheel drive? Just the front wheel. But it is, see, it's got traction uh, assist right there. Buttons. Okay. That you can, you can uh, pick your terrain. The one okay. for snow. Okay. There's a button for snow, there's a button for mud. Mm -hmm. So I don't know what I guess it chooses to try the traction. Take the middle one out and slide them together. Okay. Or you can leave a, a middle open. Mm -hmm. So you know you can kind of move them up and over. So this is kind of neat. You know, okay. Come all the way up. All right. All push button. Oh, yeah. that's interesting. Okay. And of course, that's the way the X5 works. But you don't have a slot to put this key in. As long as the key is on your person or in your purse, you don't need to, to do no, it. No, there's no slot. As long as you have it. Uh, with you. Okay. Oh. There we go. It's a three-mile one. Now, where is this car actually assembled or made? Is this a USA car? Isn't it? Yeah, Alabama. Alabama. Okay. Lincoln, Lincoln, Alabama. Here we are sitting in a 2019 Odyssey, Odyssey, Honda Odyssey Elite. This has the 10 speed automatic transmission and we're getting ready to go for a road test. This one has the shift paddles so we'll be able to uh, kind of control the shifts up and down. Turn right at this light here. Right. Okay. Turn this S it out there. Make right. sure nice smooth engagement. Nice and quiet. <laughs> right. So uh, have you been selling these pretty well or? Oh yeah, that's a good seller. Okay. That it actually shut off on the, yeah. uh, that has that feature, but that was pretty seamless. You can turn it off though. This oh, okay. button right here, I guess, probably turn it off when you stop the thing. Okay. It's like right at the light here. Okay. It's supposed to save you gas because it doesn't run while it's idling mm -hmm. at the stoplight. Yeah, I'm saying, boy, that's, that's kind of weird. Uh, yeah, smooth idling there. Yeah. The engine's not even <laughs> okay. I notice it said I had these little paddle shifters. 
Yeah, you probably want to put it down and. Uh, cell phone feature, I guess, right? Built into the power? Yeah, you Bluetooth that. Okay. Your phone, all your phone numbers will transfer in. Okay. Your uh, contacts. Absolutely full tank of fuel. Did they deliver it like that, or did you guys have to do that? We put it in when they, when they come in. Okay. So they're ready to drive, ready to buy. Take them right here. Okay. Now, just real quick, what's a down payment and what's a payment? <laughs> well, depends on your credit and, you know, what you want to do. Um, I don't know you, so you might not need any money down. It's up to you. Okay. Of course, the more you put down, the lower the payment. Okay. But being 48000 or was it, how much is yeah, this? It's almost 48000 Yeah, it's a, it's a high payment car. Right, so this is going to be about what, 500 uh, Talk to me. What's, what's that? Oh, you can get about put some money down to get the 500 probably. Okay. It's 72 months, 60 months, 66, 78, okay. yeah, it just depends on. And uh, what's the, uh, talk to me about warranty on this vehicle. Warranty is three years, 36,000. Mm -hmm. Complete, uh, coverage, no deductible on parts and labor. Tires are covered by the tire manufacturer. Okay. Um, they're covered against defects and uh, uh, mileage, but not, you know, if you run over a nail or something like that. Now that engine shut off on us, didn't it? Right? Yes. There it goes. Now I took my foot off the brake and just restarted. Now, did you want to turn on the vent side? Yeah, is that okay? I guess would be the lower gear. Okay. Uh, keep me down at a different range. Alright. And I guess I'm in D, so if you press it again, it'll put me in S. Is that right? 
pretty sure. Go ahead, try it. Aha, now I'm in S. I sure did. It jumped up. Probably where you should. Well, you should let you shift in D. So. Yeah, let me shift in D. That's what Mercedes does, too. Mm -hmm. Yeah, we were road testing a GL 550. And it lets you do anything you want. It just keeps you from doing something you shouldn't do. Right. Yeah, it's, 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 I had an Accord and uh, yeah. had the same thing, and you could actually drop your transmission in the middle of the road. And you could hit the button wrong, like a motorcycle was. Right now, now it says manual fifth, manual fourth, manual third. You can fear the engine right up. Seats folding down in the back mm -hmm. of the luggage and you know, full size can, ride. Yeah, full size and airport run and all that other stuff. I'm gonna go ahead and just take this opportunity and slip on out here. We're in the manual first gear. Oh, but it went to second. It went to second for me. It's waiting for me. I'm not gonna do anything. Oh, maybe I'm out. Okay, there's third. Waiting for me. And then we do it on one more before we turn in. Right here. Oh, I missed it. I'm gonna take this one. Is that okay? Yeah. We're going right back where we came from, right? That's right. Okay. So, I guess I can kind of do a right on red because I know it's new guys coming in here. Yep. So we'll just put it right back where we got it. That's probably good. Please. Okay. All right. So, let's go by. Instrument landing system for an airplane. All right. So let me straighten up a little yeah, bit. Yeah, cut it. Cut it. Cut it. There you go. Side now. Straighten it out. Straighten it out a little. I'm going to go ahead and get more room over here. Yeah, I'm going to go. I'm going to try just a little forward here. Very good. It kind of turned in yellow when it's tough. Well, I mean, when it locks. Yeah. Uh, and yeah. it'll turn orange when you're predicting. When it's predicting. Okay, it's kind of predicting my... The my yellow, if you'll notice, is the exact width of a parking space. Okay. So you just center it right in there, and, right. like you're doing fine. And as this one backs up, I think you'll hear parking sensors. Okay. Unless they're turned off or something. All right. And that's what we have on the, on the, BMW, on the BMW. It starts beeping at you when it thinks it's too close. This one's not working. It might not be turned on. <laughs> how, do, how do we turn that on? Uh, it should be working now. You have to go through this. Um, let's see what happens here. Auto it's disabled. Okay. Disabled. So now that's off. Okay. Um, let's Assist system setup, maybe? Could be in that. Oh, hot phone. Okay, lane departure, blind spot information. Okay. Something in might be up that one. If you hit the house button there, and go down, go down. Right there. Look at that. Oh, keep going down. Oh. Oh, that more than that on there. Right. Oh, here it is. Is this it? That's it. There it is. Okay, now, now we go back into reverse. There. Yeah, the morning approach. Yeah, mm -hmm. there we go. And there's your alert. Okay, well, I, I want to be real careful here. Are we too? Are we close enough now? Yeah, you're close enough. Okay, so I'm going to go ahead and just press park. Yeah. Go ahead and park. Okay. And uh, this does have some type of uh, of electric brake, does it? Yeah, it's um, actually it's a button uh, right there. Yeah, and you press it. Oh, I guess you have to put on your brake. 
Oh, and push the brake. And then uh, pull it. I think pull it. Put, that should work. No? Uh -huh. Push it down then. There you go. Oh, there that it comes. Goes. Okay, now. You can hear it come on. Okay, and then if I want to enable, what does that say? It says. Oh, that's a brake hold. Okay, and then if I pull it up, it releases it. To release brake, I got to press this. Then I pull it up. Okay, all right. So that's nice. Okay, we put three miles on it. All right. 